Okay, so what I'd like to talk today about is just a Eurorack USB host setup. Now the idea is pretty simple. I like USB MIDI controllers and I want to be able to use them with a Eurorack setup without having to go through a computer. And so what I've got is a Novation Launchpad Mark II Mini with just a normal USB uh, connector. I've also got this Eurorack system here with some sort of Erica synth uh, percussion, some make noise modules and some depth modules. And I've also got this Teensy 3.6. Now the cool thing about the Teensy is that it has this USB host port on it and we can connect the launch pad directly to it. And I've also got six gate outputs connected to the, the Teensy and one gate or clock input. So that's how we're gonna interface with the Eurorack. So let's get things going. First thing I'm going to do is connect an LFO signal from one of the DEPFA modules into the Teensy, and that's going to be the clock. And you can kind of see that the launch pad is uh, clocking from that signal now, and I can change the speed of that LFO to change the speed at which the launch pad is sequencing. So to start adding a kick drum pattern, it's simply a matter of connecting gate one out from the Teensy to the trigger input of a kick module. To start adding a pattern, I'm going to hold down button one and then I'm going to add some notes along the bottom row, which corresponds to gate one output on the Teensy. And then I'm going to connect the snare to the output of gate 2. I'm going to set up gate 3 as my clap. And if I hold down button 2, every note that I put down is going to play every second repetition instead of every single repetition. I'll use gate out 4 to trigger the tom. And gate out 5 will be a classic bongo sound. I'll use my last gate for a cowbell. So from a programming point of view, it's all pretty straightforward. You know, the code is written in, in Arduino with the Teensy Duino add-on and that allows you to use the Teensy 3.6 as a USB host device, which can then send and receive messages easily to something like the Launchpad. Now the cool thing is that we're not limited to using the Launchpad, that could be any other MIDI controller, and we're also not limited to using gates as inputs and outputs on the Teensy. For our Euro rack, this could also be control voltages. So there's a lot of room here for expanding, on these ideas and I think that's really exciting. Mm -hmm. 